once I saw that I was suffering with hair loss from my sister loss, I started doing research. Um, I do a lot of natural products, natural things myself. Um, one of the things is I don't eat red meat. I just eat fish and vegetables. Um, more so naturalist when it comes to even when I get sick. Um, but the development came as I did research and study, I found that essential oil, not just coconut. A lot of people go, oh, coconut. And I'm like, no, there's got to be something else besides coconut. So when I started doing research about hair loss, I found that a lot of essential oils combined with shea butter. And I knew shea butter had to be the base of the product, which that's not all of it. The majority of it is the essential oils. And when I found out the seven different essential oils that it can improve hair growth, I just played with it probably for about a year. For some, the first batch that I made, I'm going to honestly tell you, Elaine, it smelled like um, <laughs> your mom's kitchen, uh, one of those ointments that you put on for, <laughs> like, Ben Gay. One of my girlfriends, one of my clients said, Monique, no, this is not it. I'm going to be smelling like Ben Gay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> got to change the formula. And I was like, okay, I got a little bit of too much cedar in here. So I changed it and kept playing with it, kept uh, switching it around a little bit. And I was like, okay, this is it. And even today, like I make an oil as well, because um, some people don't like the shea butter, so I do an oil. And I'm coming up with my third product line, which is a leave-in conditioner. Very simple. Same thing. It'll be mixed with moisture, but it'll be a one-time package where you just like a little trial package, put it on. Because you have to LOC the hair. Most people don't know. You got a liquid oil and cream. You got to do all of that. So that's how it came to fruition. And I was like, okay, we'll mix a little bit of organic white shea butter. I don't use yellow. I did start off with yellow at first, but I found out the white is the best as far as it mixes with the oil and, and a lot more organic as well. So that's how I came up with it. Just mix it and plan with it and getting the formula together to – even today, I have to literally look at the recipe in the formula as I make it because I want to make it exactly like it always has. People say, oh, will you ever mix any vanilla, mango? No. My key ingredient to, to stimulate the hair follicles is my peppermint. And I love the, I love the peppermint scent in it. But uh, it has seven different essential oils. 